Hello students, intercession in spring 2022 at your San Diego Community College District is here and we wanna make sure that you're ready for your registration appointment for City, Mesa, Miramar, and the San Diego College of Continuing Education. Now, if you're planning on taking on-campus classes or taking advantage of our awesome in-person services, you wanna make sure that you update your vaccine status via our Cleared For website. Let's go ahead and get started so we can show you how to do it. The first thing you're going to want to do is visit our planning for a safe return to campus website. Here you're going to find tons of great information about how we're returning to campus safe. You're going to want to scroll all the way down and find the green button called cleared for registration. After reaching this website, you're going to want to enter in your 10 digit student ID number. If your ID number doesn't come up, we have a website that you can visit to get some support and go ahead and press next. After submitting your user ID number, you will receive an email titled SDCCD Welcome to Clear 4. In here, you will find your unique URL to begin the process of updating your vaccine status. After reaching this page, click the blue box that says read and accept disclaimer. Feel free to read the disclaimer and click the button that says, I accept. After reaching this page, click the blue box that states, complete your personal information. Please note, you only have to fill in the information with the red asterisk. Once you complete, press save. A notification will pop up that says personal information, personal info successfully updated, press okay. Upon reaching this page, click the blue box that says check your symptoms. You will get a notice and you'll want to read and press continue. In this section, you will be asked a series of questions regarding COVID-19 symptoms. For this question, you're going to want to select California. Upon selecting California, you're going to want to select other location in California. After reaching this page, click the blue button that says submit. Upon reaching this page, go ahead and click the blue box that says go to home screen. Upon reaching your home screen, click the blue button that says enter your vaccination data. When beginning this process, it is advised that you have a picture of your vaccine card available to upload. After finding the photo of your vaccine card, press upload. After uploading your vaccination card, you're going to want to select your vendor and also select your vaccination dates. After pressing the blue add button, you will get a notification that says submitted successfully. Press OK. After submitting, you will want to check to make sure that enter your vaccine data button is no longer there. You will receive notification via text message and via email. Congratulations, you have officially submitted.